Hello guys, this is Dags. And I'm President Ross. Today we got this iPad keyboard by the company known as Chisona. They sent it to us for free in exchange for a YouTube review of the product. It is supposed to be how much, baby? $60. And guess what? We didn't have to pay a dime for it. That's why we love this thing. Now let's go ahead and open this right on up. It is for iPad 9th generation, which is what this one is right here. Open it? Yep. It's like a present. Yeah, an early Christmas present in <laughs> November. <laughs> Almost got it. Oh, wow. Look at that. All wrapped up, too. And there is a copy of the order and the protective packaging. It's in a little box. I can get this open. And it is called the magnetic wireless keyboard. So it connects to the back of your iPad magnetically. This is the charge cable inside. It's a type C it looks like. A type C she says. And here's the keyboard. And here we go. Moment of truth. Is it good? Yes, it is. Looks very nice and very high quality. Very rugged, too. Oh, wow. That's wow. Nice. Wow. Oh, wow. It's even got the magnetic backing, just like it claims in the pictures, the magnetic backing. As you can see, it's super shiny. This is the plastic that's protecting it keeping it from activating. So you peel the plastic off and put the iPad in and it should stick magnetically. And you mentioned the stylus. And the picture on Amazon showed how you set this magnetic keyboard upright so you can type or edit, send email, play games. Baby, you want to demonstrate how you do that? Hmm. What she's going to do is take the back piece and bend it on this ridge really hard. It's going to snap. You're going to feel like you're bending it like Beckham, that old movie. You don't want to bend it like Beckham, but you do want to bend this like Beckham. And you snap it really hard and lean the iPad back. And then it sets into place just like a laptop or a tap top, a tablet laptop. And that's exactly how it looks, ladies and gentlemen. And look at how it looks nice with the screen and the keyboard sits flush. The power button's on this side. The USB-C charger port's on the right side as well. Now, baby... You want to uh, demonstrate what color this is going to display on the keyboard? Purple. There we go. It is the color purple or pink, just like she said. It does have a backlit keyboard. Yep. Now it is time to show how to connect this device. Turn the iPad screen on. Go into our settings. Bluetooth. And here it is. It shows up as Bluetooth keyboard. Tap it. Hit the pair button. And it connected. Now, bring up an app such as YouTube. Tap on the search icon, 
And how about Phase Rug, one of our favorite YouTubers. And look, it's typing. And now, with the mouse, you get the mouse icon on your screen, which is good for iMovie, photo editing, if you use that and you don't want to use your touch screen. And you should be able to left click, and look, it works. And here's Phase Rug's video from a day ago. I surprised my friend with her celebrity crush. And just like on a MacBook, they have the gestures. Using two fingers and pushing upward, you can scroll down. Two fingers and scrolling downward, it moves up. So it really does turn your iPad into a MacBook of sorts. What do you think about that, baby? I like it. With this keyboard and mouse touchpad combo, would you need to get a MacBook Pro? No. You heard it here. What are your overall thoughts on the keyboard, baby? It's really nice. It's heavy duty. Is it better than the other one we have? Yes. And do you like think it's it. worth the $60? Yeah. Any other thoughts you got on it, baby? No. I like the rugged design. I like the magnetic backing. I was skeptical at first as to how powerful the magnetic backing would be. And it's held up for this whole review since we've started using it and put the iPad in there. The keyboard is very accurate. The mouse pad is very accurate. There's a little bit of a delay, but that's normal with Bluetooth. And I would say that the backlit keyboard and the keyboard being heavy duty and not lightweight like what she said. It being a heavy keyboard makes this way, way better than this lightweight keyboard. Keep in mind, this lightweight keyboard is also backlit, but it's easy to move around. It slides a whole bunch. This, it's hard to get to slide. This, it's really easy to slide. I would definitely recommend this Chisona iPad case and keyboard over this one. I'm President Ross. And I'm Bags. And we are... Out. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs>